Hello and welcome back to Dyson Sphere program. So a couple days I came across this video of the achievement faster than light, which I didn't even know it existed. I'm not very much into achievements and stuff, but I found this really interesting. So I'm going to link the original video of uh, this YouTube creator in the description. He did it on, I believe it was on G type star. I'm gonna try it and do it on the black hole. You wanna avoid black holes? Let's see what is the difference. So basically we wanna reach a sailing speed of 3000 meters per second in non-warp transportation. I'm gonna cut the video up a little bit so it's not as long. Basic idea is that you are near the star and you accelerate going towards it until you reach 2000 meters per second and you want to start roughly five or six AUs away from the set star so once you reach 2000 and then you let shift go the mecha should start slowly picking up the speed okay and there we go 2001 as you get closer to the star you're gonna start accelerating uh, more rapidly but once you click if you click shift in during this time while you're going towards the star if you click shift and it's gonna just reset the speed back to 2000 so I'm gonna click shift right now and it goes back to 2000 so don't click shift once you're in uh, sail mode just keep going towards the star without clicking the shift button and while we're on the subject talking about clicking buttons go click the button please come on push the button come on push the button yeah come on push, button. push the goddamn button push the goddamn as we get closer, you can see Mega starts accelerating faster. We don't want to fly into the star, so we're just going to fly by. You want to avoid black holes? We're going to use warp speed to get away from the star. About, like, this, this is a little bit too far. Anyway, we're going to turn around. And we're going to go back at the star. And I flew a little bit too far away from the star. Uh, at 10 AU is way too much. You want to be like maybe three or four away so you can uh, Accelerate more rapidly because at this distance you don't really increase your sailing speed at all and Another thing if if you attempt this make sure you have enough of the Space warpers with you and make sure you have enough fuel to fuel your mecha as well. So even at this distance, like two AUs, the acceleration is quite slow. So I think like two AU is roughly the good distance away from the star. Let's see how many runs it takes for us to get to 3k speed. Okay, this is enough. There's no point flying actually further than like two AUs, really. Even now, it's quite slow. Let's not even make two AUs. Let's try to make like one and a half. I wish black holes had like different mechanics than the regular stars. If you fly too close to the black hole, it will have like a different effect on mecha or something like that. It would be fun. Otherwise, all the stars, doesn't matter what are their properties, they do the same. And obviously black holes, I think they should have a different effect. I think devs will come up with something cool in the future. Do you have any ideas what it could or should be? No, we're being sucked into the black hole. Not really. I wish we were. <laughs> I 
you know what, even after a couple of hundred hours into the game, I still find these graphics amazing. We should get the achievement on this one. And there we go. Faster than light achievement. Oh, this is a nice view. How fast do you think we can get with the mecha? Let's push the limit. Let's get to 4k. No! What did I do? Did I press shift? I think I pressed shift at some point. God damn it. It's really easy to misclick on this because the caps lock for the warp speed and shift, they're right next to each other. I probably just misclicked it. Oh well, let's go again. I wonder how far we can get with the speed. Or maybe there is a limit how fast you can go on um, just sail speed without warp. Maybe there is a limit. Maybe I didn't click the shift. Maybe I just reached the speed limit. <laughs> Hey, so this is me from the future and I realized while editing the video what happened there is I was trying to equip um, Space Warpers and as I did as I always do I hold shift and I click to equip all of them and What happened there is uh, I end up clicking shift and resetting my speed back to 2k. So yeah, I guess third time is the charm We're getting to 4k and we are at 4k. Awesome. Oh, we dropped below 4k. Let's test it a little bit further. Let's see if we can get to 5k, maybe? Is it just me or it seems like the acceleration has um, has slowed down? Or maybe it hasn't slowed down. It's just um, it's a lot faster. The distance that Mecha covers from 1 AU until it gets to the star. So it has less time to accelerate. Does that make sense? Because when I was at 2k, I was gaining about 200 meters per second per one run. And now I'm gaining like 100. So now it's 1490. Let's say it's 14, 4500. Let's see how much we gain in this run. Can we get 100? Because definitely when we started in the beginning from 2k, we gain like 200 per one run. And now we're barely getting 100. Yep. Not even that. See? 4571. It's not even 100 per one run. Okay, and I think I'm gonna end it here. It just it just slows down. I think if we get over 5k, it's gonna slow down even more. How much we can accelerate. So yeah, thanks guys for watching. Um, go push the button, please. Thank you and bye bye. Come on, push the button. Come on, push the button. Yeah, come on, push the button. Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn